Frame family, welcome to another rumors and speculation video. It has recently come to my attention through some viewers that an RTX 3070 Super or TI variant might be on the horizon. Now as always, take this info with a huge grain of salt. I'm not saying I'm being skeptical, but I just don't firmly believe it until I see it. However, it does make sense for Nvidia to make this kind of move. I mean, look at the last several generations with the TI and the Super cards being released later down their generational lines. So with that being said, let's get to it. Now a lot of reliable details on what this card has for specs are not being revealed and the sources that do are semi sketchy and don't make a lot of sense when compared to the specs of the RTX 3070 that Nvidia released to us during their live event. But we do have an interesting list from Lenovo on their Legion T7 gaming desktop that shows the GPU as an RTX 3070 Ti with 16 gigabytes of GDDR6 VRAM. Since before the reveal of the RTX flagship GPUs from Nvidia, there has been rumors circulating about a Ti or super variants of the 3080 3070 and even the yet to be announced RTX 3050 that essentially doubles each of their VRAM capacities and assumedly adds some other enhancements such as slightly more CUDA cores. So this news isn't exactly new, but seeing it be officially listed definitely raises some eyebrows, especially because it matches the rumors suggesting these new models will double their original VRAM amounts. Aside from the amount of rumored VRAM, there really isn't much else to go off of spec wise, but it's safe to assume that the memory bus will retain its 256 bit size as the base RTX 3070 model but I'm guessing they may increase the memory and core clock speed slightly while also adding some more CUDA cores to give it a small boost in general performance on top of the extra VRAM. Of course, as you can imagine, there is no information or rumor on dates for this Lenovo desktop and of course for the RTX 3070 Ti itself, but I can't imagine a desktop listing releasing around six months after it appears online, even though my logical thinking doesn't want to suggest that a 3070 Ti will be released this soon after Nvidia just officially announced the base RTX 3070 with a release window that's a month from now. At the end of the day, who knows, like I always say, take this news with a grain of salt, but I want to know, what do you guys think about this? Could there be a typo or a mistake? Is it too soon for a TI or super variant to be talked about, or do you think that this is totally possible, especially with this listing? Let me know down in the comments below, and I will certainly discuss this with you guys. That's all I have for you in this video, just a quick update of what I've heard. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, it would mean the world to me if you hit that like button, so YouTube might throw it out to other people who can discover it as well. It's been a pleasure. Stay safe, stay happy, and keep Keep on gaming.